Hi guys, Alex Fred and Junior here with the uh, second half of the uh, submarine parts in GTA 5. Uh, this, yeah, so it's just, yeah, some more submarine parts. Some more swimming. Swimming. Yeah, oh, you're all... on the other end of the map. Oh, now. really? They are quite far yeah. away from that one. Okay. These are all sort of much closer, sort of around Los Santos, basically, these ones. Um, but yeah, this first well, one's just kind of. So I guess just it's down not there. all from the same submarine. Are those like assault there? rifles uh, you're spinning. picking up down here? Yeah, you can also you also find a bunch of weapons scattered around, which is kind of oh, interesting. Clearly in working condition, having been down here for years. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. And then yeah, that's that's one down there, and then this next one is along here. That's some body armor you can see right next to it as well. You're trapped? No, not. Oh, it'd be funny. Yeah. Though. You're trapped underneath <laughs> and, like the other thing. Yeah. But nice. again, like oh, last no, time, no. you need to swim. You need to be in the specific dinghy that was at the sonar collection docks, and. Um, and yeah, well, just and come all the way around here, and then come yes. Yeah, oh, I, I just did it all in one go and went from like top top uh, top left right the way around, basically looped. Yeah, it. All right. Um, this one, I don't know why I'm holding on the pause. Yeah, why are you long. looking at the map? It's so long. Okay. Oh, yeah, this one is in, in the fact, weeds. Not in, not in not in some seaweed. It is on this little uh, <laughs> pylon thing here. I don't know. Right, don't go searching don't know around what. the seaweed for ages. Don't know why I was doing that. Um, and then. Again, these this one here. There's a cut. There's a few just like along this little edge bit here. Uh, it's just around the corner from there. Basically, you could probably swim there, but I think I got out and got the dinghy just because it was quicker. It's easier to just and it's use just a the submarine, line. which is already in the game. Uh, you yeah. can't actually use the submarine. I think you need the dinghy specifically, which gives you the. You can see that blue dot there on the map is is the dinghy, and you need that for the the tracking basically. Oh, okay. For, to, oh, right. to find find them all. That's it's quite. Specific, it, it just makes it easier to find them. Basically, I wonder what the find, blue dot was. You can find, you can just, you can find them all normally, but um, it's just easier having the dinghy with you. That it's the spe again, the specific one that spawns at the sonar collection docks. I assume uh, you could also do this without the scuba gear, but it would be much more of a faff. You could, but it's just like automatically equipped when I dived out, so it's yeah. like I, didn't, I didn't really have a huge amount of choice. I yeah, what are you doing to, here? To get this, to get this one a little bit. Wow! Uh, just, just trying to get, trying. I'm get defeated the by these three wooden planks. Yeah. To be honest, I thought you were doing quite well at swimming so far, but... <laughs> yeah, I cut out a few attempts where I was just kind of swimming around trying to get something and then just, like, cross-faded between them. Oh, so it goes right up into Los Santos. This, like, goes, yeah, you, you start going up one of the... I think this next one here is, like, right up... This is right up one of the canals. And you can see it just there on the right of the screen. It's like... Oh, yeah. Yeah, just, just south of the sea race. This is... Giant then, submarine exploded, and its parts went all over the. Uh, that's, yeah, that's what I don't understand. The whole the, the premise the premise of this mission is basically someone's submarine has broken, and it's somehow broken all around the coast of Los Santos. <laughs> and it's all not, exactly the same part as well. Yeah, it is. It's all yeah. Yeah, they probably I, I didn't don't really understand they just it. Had bits but. falling off for ages, and they went, "Wait a second, <laughs> my submarine is full just of holes." Falling off. Yeah. <laughs> But yeah, so this one's like underneath a pier Stuck somewhere. Stuck in the wall for a bit there. And uh, just got that, yeah. And now we're over back in the deep ocean bit. Back swimming. I basically just swam around the right up through that little canal bit under the bridges and then out round this way. Oh, well, at least it's good for your lungs. Yeah, your well, lungs is pass, it? I think because ends up... you're wearing scuba gear. It's, it's, just, it's just because I think the lung, the lung capacity just increases when you spend time underwater. So you can oh, right. just you know swim out normally, or if you have scuba gear, just like. Because your lung capacity increases if you crash the car into the water and just sat there for a bit. Well, no, because you drown. Yeah, but I mean, you, you still if you're in you the still, car in the water, does it count as underwater in uh, terms of lung so. capacity? I think so. Probably. I, yeah. Bit of a waste of a car. Yeah, I think so. Though. Probably, yeah. You just climb out onto the beach and steal the first person car you see. I'm driving this into the ocean. Yeah. <laughs> you have no choice in the matter. You've got this. You've got the honour of letting me drive your car into yeah. the sea. Yeah. <laughs> you just see this guy running back and forth between the ocean and uh, people's cars and just driving them straight in. Oh, nearly not. Deary me. Anyway, oh, we're almost done. So yeah, this is the uh, last one here, and it's just like there's this pipe you can see running there. Uh, it's just balanced on the edge edge of it. One thing I found slightly disappointing: you can't actually like swim into this. I'm trying. I'm trying to line up so I can swim into the pipe. You you can't swim through the pipe. It's just like oh, an invisible oh. wall. Oh. I can't I wait really to see what you that. get when you finish. Oh, okay, so, what yeah. could it be? So now, when when you're done with that, you need to go. This is you need to go back with Michael to the sonar collection docks. Stylish entrance here. Michael. 
yeah, it has to be with Michael because that's he's it's Strangers and Freaks mission that triggered it. Uh, um, and when you're done, you will get a glorious ten dollars and a photograph of someone. Wow. wow, that is all you get for completing this mission. And then it, you have the choice to kill or leave alive the person who who gave it to you. Fuck uh, me, I just said, definitely kill leave him alive. That. Definitely, <laughs> even yeah. in Jesus real life, just popper. Just popper. It's, yeah, it, it's the most unrewarding collectible thing Fucking i have hell. no idea why but yeah and you end up throwing the photo away anyway so you as well so you can't even so you made ten dollars you made ten dollars from that and michael's got what five million how, how much did the uh dock place cost with all the stuff oh god i don't know the, the dock the dock thing actually is based on the nuclear waste which we're doing next week um all right so that that actually and you get twenty three thousand dollars per nuclear waste thing you return so that actually makes it like makes its money back oh, okay. uh, the dinghy just sort of spawns here anyway. Ten for And you get that double. strange drink mission. Jesus. But yeah, so that's uh, those last two videos were uh, submarine parts in GTA 5. We'll be back next week with uh, nuclear waste, which should be wonderfully fun. Thank God.